There are huddles taking place. Fadnavis reaches J.P. Nadda residence. The BJP chief meeting one of the top leaders of Maharashtra, Devendra Fadnavis. That meeting is taking place. Devendra Fadnavis landed today in Delhi. So with this meeting, are there possibly going to be a strategy put in place about what happens next in Maharashtra? BJP till now has officially distanced itself. But now Devendra Fadnavis meeting J.P. Nadda. Now remember this meeting comes just before Sharad Pawar and Udav Thakre are also meeting. So a little correction there that uh, this is uh, the J.P. Nadda residence where Devendra Fadnavis has arrived. So it is the Fadnavis Nadda meeting right now, the BJP top brass meeting and possibly amid what's going on in Maharashtra that that could be on the top agenda. These visuals are coming in from the national capital, Delhi. But while this meeting is with J.P. Nadda, we are being told on agenda next on the itinerary for Fadnavis is to meet Amit Shah. So while this meeting takes place in Delhi, what's about to happen in the state of Maharashtra? Sharad Pawar and Udav Thakre have also spoken before a cabinet meeting that comes at about 5 p.m. in just half an hour from now. So remember this constant permutations, combinations that's taking place, deliberations that are on. BJP starts to have these meetings and huddles. No direct reference, quote, reaction on camera about if this is about Maharashtra, if the BJP is intervening officially about what their next move will be. But we can tell you that right now with this meeting coming in, on the other hand, Pawar and Udav Thakre meet, uh, speaking to each other. Udav Thakre said to hold a cabinet meeting at about 5 p.m., which he will be likely joining through a virtual link. Too many meetings, too many huddles taking place. Now for Maharashtra, it's very clear. They're trying to save their government. What is the Bharatiya Janata Party up to? What is up their sleeve? What are the numbers with them? What is their next plan of action? So a very quiet BJP, so to say. But it's uh, for all to see what's really been happening. Remember, a few days ago, our sources had told us that uh, there was a possible meeting between Fadnavis and Eknath Chinde in Vadodara in Gujarat. But nothing that the BJP would say on record. At this point, as you can see, and I want to add in here that Fadnavis walking in uh, with uh, Mahesh Jait Malani, one of the top uh, lawyers there, if I can see correctly. He lands in Delhi. And now that meeting with JP Nadda at least has started. So the meeting with uh, Amit Shah also on the cards in just about the next few hours. Because right now, remember, today is Tuesday. 30th June is when the accommodation in the Radisson Blue Hotel is in Guwahati. Two more days. Are we looking at this week itself where there could be some big development coming in from the state of Maharashtra? Eknath Chinde also knowing fairly well that there have been reporters deployed outside the Radisson Blue Hotel for days. Today walks out, smiles, waves, sends out videos, interacting, smiling, happily talking to his people. Devendra Fadnavis arrives in Delhi, does a namaskar, backed by top legal eyes, meets J.P. Nadda. Eshwarya Paliwal is joining me right outside from where the meeting is taking place. So, Eshwarya, at least with J.P. Nadda, the BJP chief, Fadnavis meeting has started. Have they said anything officially, what is on agenda, or it is just for all to see what's unfolding in Maharashtra has connections in Delhi? Well, what's on agenda clearly is, uh, you know, both of them will discuss exactly what the legalities of the issue are. Uh, from what we understand, we will also see other BJP leaders also in some time coming uh, at JP Nadda's house. Now, this is a meeting which was supposed uh, to take place a couple of hours back. It's taking place now. Even the Fadamas, in fact, landed in Delhi at about 2 p.m. And since then, uh, from what we understand, he's been speaking with experts, understanding what the exact legality of... Uh, the situation is, and this also comes just 24 hours after the Supreme Court has given a sort of relief to the rebel MLAs. They have to now submit their answers by the 12th of July, so they have that much time. All these things will be ironed out, and meeting the Bharti Janata Party President J.P. Nadda is a clear indication of what the Bharti Janata Party is at the moment planning. Uh, we expect other leaders also to come and to meet J.P. Nadda and Devendra Fadnavis at J.P. Nadda's house in some time. Ashwara, please uh, keep tracking all the latest on that.